Hey guys, welcome to Logical Humor. Today we'll be creating something like this that you can see, uh, that you are seeing. We're gonna create a table with employee details, employee name, date of birth, and salary, with also a, uh, with also an option to sort these uh, details by column values, by name in ascending order, by date of birth or salary. Like uh, by default, it is uh, sorted by name in ascending order. Bhanu, Bhaskar, Dinkar, Divakar, and Ravi. And we can uh, change it by say we want to sort it by date of birth. See 65, 75, 85, 86 and we might also be needing to sort by salary and $600 and then $26,000, $200. So for this we are we are using AngularJS and let's get back to the code that how we have actually done it. Okay, so first of all we have created this ASPX, uh, uh, this is our view because AngularJS uh, uses MVC concept. First of all we have uh, uh, taken this AngularJS script we, you can download it uh, from its official site and then we have uh, also given um, provided reference to this JS script where our actual angular JS code will be present so let's get back to uh, get to it so first of all we create a model module here using the angular object um, ang uh, module function and uh, using that module we are then created the uh, creating the controller and the controller, uh, to, uh, the controller is used to create the model, and the model is needs to be attached to this uh, dollar scope object. So our model will uh, will const uh, constitute uh, for an employees that is an array of uh, uh, JSON objects of employee details, which contains name, uh, date of birth, and salary properties, and then we uh, attach that. Uh, uh, employees array to the scope and so employees will be the model and we also uh, need to provide a sort column so that it will and we this sort column by default will be by name will be name and then we can change it as and when uh, using the drop down selection we will change it and this is the style sheet we want our table to have uh, yeah these uh, styles table and every each element Okay, so next get back to them. We provide reference to all these Angular JS, JavaScript, uh, and style sheet. Here also we have uh, provided reference to Angular JS. We just we just need to drag and drop, and automatically the reference will be added. And here uh, we also need to provide the uh, reference to the module using ng app. Ng stands for Angular. And then we have also provided uh, reference to the controller here. Then we have added the drop down list here. In that drop-down list, uh, yeah, we we uh, we are attaching the model sort column that we had created here. Sort column by default, its value will be name uh, as seen here, and then later, as per the selection, we can change it to date of birth and salary. See, because uh, we are attaching this uh, model to the drop-down list, so this by default value of the sort column, which is name, it will also change. Based on the selection, it will change to date of birth or salary. And then we are creating the table to display the employee details. And that details are uh, using employee, uh, means, means uh, yeah, the columns will be employee name, date of birth, and salary. And then we are using ng repeat uh, directive. ng repeat directory is, will be like a for each loop. For, uh, so it will be read as for each employee imp in employees and then here we are using the order by filter to sort column sort column is the model which we'll get from the drop down list and false mean it will be in ascending order if it was true then it would be in descending order and there we are using the binding expression with two uh, these curly braces and we get the name property for each row date of birth property then we are again formatting it a bit using the date filter <coughs> into this format and then currency then salary also we are providing in currency format by default is American dollar so let's say that we want uh, an option to, pro uh, to uh, provide these uh, means uh, to sort in uh, descending order as well so what we'll do is remove this false because we won't be hard coding it here and let's just add more list items for descending as well 
so let's just draw it name as a disk and just add it to date of birth and salary also so here what we need to do is the value will be positive or uh, plus sign will be for ascending and minus sign negative sign will be for descending so let's try it out yeah there by default it is name and uh, we can just buy salary if suppose we want to descend it descending order by name in descending Ravi is here so it has happened as you can see if you have any doubts about it you can ask me you can if you like the video you can like you can comment your doubts or if you want some other video similar videos you can also provide that in comments and uh, you can subscribe my channel if you are like more videos if you want to watch more videos you can also check out my other videos which range from di diverse uh, topics mythology education my travel experiences a bit of comedy after all the name of the channel is illogical humor so guys thank you for watching over and out